yourself. It is a flow detector for your home. You cover it up with pipe, you install it yourself. It measures the water flow in your home. This can prevent leaks. This can uh, shut off water remotely if you leave, let's say, a summer home. This sends notifications to your smartphone, and you can also set it to function automatically. It's coming out early Q2 and it's targeted for $100. Okay, you got it. If you're looking to make your home into a smart home, and you already have, let's say, a security camera, a smart lock, all the things you'd need, now it's time to start getting into the nitty gritty of it. This is the Leak Smart Smart Valve, and this can maintain and regulate water flow in your home. So what you're gonna do with this device, cut open a pipe, install it yourself, or get someone to help if you're not that handy with soldering iron, and then this will measure the water flow coming through the pipe of your choice. If there's a lot of flow and irregularity, something that might be leaking, it will send a notification to your smartphone, or you can set it to shut off automatically beyond a certain point. Uh, what you can also do with this device is shut off the water entirely. Let's say you are leaving a summer home for the season, let's say you've got to shut the water off because of an emergency, just cut the entire flow off and go and fix it later. This is something of a damage prevention mechanism, and you can, it's not going to, uh, maybe save you that much money, but it can prevent you from having to spend $20,000 instead of, and do a repair bill of maybe 200 instead. So this device is uh, definitely targeted for the DIYer. It could be a bit of a, uh, a process to install, but if you get a kick out of maintaining your home, doing it yourself, uh, this is definitely something to look into, the Leak Smart Smart Valve. This is uh, targeted for early Q2, uh, exclusively at Lowe's, and it works with the Iris, smart home system, targeted for about $100 with no final pricing released yet. At CES 2014, for Tom's Guide, this is Marshall Onoroff.